There's mixed reactions surrounding a proposed development in Newport News. The project could bring more than 500 new homes. Nico Clemens found out city leaders have wanted to develop this property for a while. It's a concept and proposal that would significantly change the Jefferson Avenue, Yorktown Road area. More than 500 homes between Newport News Park and Yorktown Naval Weapons Station housing. The Newport News Economic Development Authority and Weldon Field and Row are working towards developing the property. Haley Day lives in the Lee Hall area. While she understands Newport News is growing and more housing is needed, she's not too sure about the proposed site. The biggest thing is making sure that we don't get too close to building on top of natural sites that were involved in great pieces of our history. The development would surround the Inview Plantation House, a site where people come visit. While EDA leaders have said they will not impact the fields that are part of the Inview property, many like Day are leery of the proposal. We should be a lot more cautious about building so close to historical landmarks and cutting into Greenland. This isn't the first time the EDA has tried to develop this property. There were talks in the past of even bringing a mall here. A lot needs to happen before development goes up, including rezoning and a traffic impact study. Newport News' Director of Development, Florence Kingston, says the city needs new quality housing. She says the EDA and developer have tried to find the right balance of not bringing too much development and trying to protect the property surrounding the Inview House. And they should still keep in mind the wildlife that is in those woods and trying to make sure that you go about the proper procedures of removing that wildlife before you start tearing it down. Day says whatever happens, she wants it done right. Protecting history while also creating new history. In Newport News, Nico Clemens, 13 News Now.